Hello everyone, um, this is my second video and as you can see it's my Q&A. Um, so I thought I'd ask my first, first video if anyone has any questions to ask me, just try and make this a bit easier on me and give me something to make a video about, um, obviously it's my second video so this might make me feel a bit more comfortable. Um, and I was asked quite a few questions. Um, so I'm just going to say the ones that I was given. I'm going to try and give you advice as good as I can. I'm not a professional. Um, I'm, you know, I've only been doing weight training for a year. Um, so, you know, yeah, I'm, ju I'm just going to try. So uh, question number one. Martin said, what is my fitness goal? I've got them all written down. What is my fitness goal? And what was my motivation to change myself? Hmm. Um, my goal, personally, is to get on the stage. Um, you know, I, I would want to grow in confidence, and this this has really helped my confidence. Um, also, um, for the last few years, I. I started becoming unhappy with myself. Uh, I felt like I could just put on weight, uh, sitting in on the computer all day, um, you know, playing games. <laughs> um, as much fun as that was, I was just putting on weight, not doing anything, no activities, um, you know, going out. Um, so yeah, I think I just had enough of feeling down looking at myself. Um, I put on a stone and a half in about a year, two years. Um, yeah, so I just thought that's that's it. I, I want to go to a gym. Um, uh, I was told about pro gym in Salt Ash, so we thought, okay, why not you try try weight training? Um, so I thought, yeah, good start. So we started doing that, um, which I thought this this will make me feel a lot better. Um, yeah, so my goal, that was my vo motivation to change myself, I just wasn't happy with myself. Um, you know, it's about time, you do some, if you're not happy, do something about it. Um, so that was, that was my motivation. My goal is to, like I said, to get up on the stage, um, but I aim to win. <laughs> uh, I'm very competitive, I do want to win, I, d I don't believe people that say, they're just doing it to make you know to prove that they can do it. Uh, no, it's bullshit. Everybody wants to win. You know, everyone wants to be a winner. Um, at least I'm being honest. I, I want to go on that stage and kick ass. I want to do the best I can um, and take back a trophy. Uh, if I place, fantastic. But I would like to win. <laughs> um, yeah. So that's that's that question. I hope that answered that. Um, number two was by Bobaloo. Um this was on my snapchat should women do weight training and cardio if they want to lose weight or should they focus on just cardio at the gym mm. um, I'm gonna be honest here for the last year yeah, just under a year I didn't do any cardio whatsoever yeah, I mean my only source of cardio was walking to the gym and back um, going shopping and you know, things like that. Um, I just did weight training for any, practically the entire year. Uh, now I have added cardio because I want to compete so I don't believe you need cardio to lose weight. That's just my opinion. I, I did it. I lost a stone and a half um, by just weight training. Uh, now that I'm doing cardio obviously it's a little bit different because I'm, you know, I've got to get ready for the stage, so cardio is kind of a must to help lose that extra bit of fat. Um, but I do recommend weightlifting for anyone that wants to lose weight um, because nobody wants that excess skin. Um, you know, you, as good as it is losing weight, you're still not going to be happy with yourself because you're going to see all those, you know, loose bits. Go and lift weight. I mean, you don't, you don't turn into a man, you know. 
everybody seems to think that lifting weights you're gonna start looking like a man do I look like a man I, I hope I don't but <laughs> um yeah it's no no you won't start looking like a man so I personally suggest weight training um, and maybe add a bit of cardio you know it depends on what your goals are um, yeah I hope that helped um, number three how do I maintain my exercise schedule? Hmm. Um, I've got a goal, and I want to I want to complete that goal. Um, so I set my day kind of around my meals and my my gym. Um, I already I as I'm with Showgirl Fitness, they've given me an exercise plan. So I know what I'm doing every day. Um, I don't just go to the gym anymore and think, well, I'm going to do this today. So I have actually got a, a set schedule. Um, so I get up, you know, do what I need to do for the rest of the day. Currently I do my cardio first and then I'll leave it for a bit and then I'll go to the gym and train. Um, I don't skip days. If, if I feel, feel down, I don't care. I still go to the gym. Um, I have two days off a week from the gym <laughs> um, one of those I have to do cardio still um, but the other I just relax with my family so yeah I I, just, I don't know I just I motivate myself really I, I just say to myself I don't say anything to myself I just I just think right let's go yeah get up get ready go that's it um, yeah um, next question, Kai. What is my favourite workout? Hmm. Favourite workout? Well, if you mean... Right, okay, someone... Kai's asked favourite workout and another person's asked favourite workout and least favourite. Um, now I don't know if you mean, like, for, you know, if I'm doing a certain area with body or do you mean an exercise um, if you mean an exercise it would probably be chest uh, well it's not it's not my it's not my, my least favorite I think would be chest because I I feel not because I don't like it because I, li I like training everything I personally do um, but I feel my pecs are getting a bit big uh, so <laughs> I don't I don't like doing chest uh, my favourite my favourite thing to train would be back I absolutely love doing back um, as well as legs I like doing that um, yeah yeah I, I think that's I, mean, I hope that answered the question for both of you um, yeah next question Ash Bash how long do I spend at the gym each day? Right, well, it's a bit of a silly question um, <laughs> because it depends on how busy the gym is. Um, it depends on what I'm training. Um, it depends if I'm doing supersets or if I'm doing, you know, if I'm if I'm doing supersets or I'm doing simple sets. Um, if I'm doing su su supersets and the gym's quiet. Um, if I'm doing, I mean, it could be, yeah, it ranges. It really ranges from half an hour to an hour and a half. It really does depend a lot on how busy the gym is. Um, it's only a small gym, so I could be sharing and waiting for uh, equipment. Yeah, that's as good as I can answer that. <laughs> um, the next one. Ellie asked, ideal breakfast and lunch before the gym. Okay, that depends. I'm just going to tell you what I used to have. That depends on when you go to the gym. Um, if you're going... Right, okay, if I, if I go to the gym, or if I get up at 10 o'clock in the morning, I have my breakfast, which will be oats, oats and water. 
a handful of oats and a bit of water mixed together. I mean, it doesn't sound exciting, but it does. Um, it does the job. Um, and then about two hours later, I will have some chicken, some rice, and some veg. Um, or you could have a bit of fish. You know, uh, I don't know if you're a vegetarian or whatever. Uh, I'm just going to tell you why I have. Uh, used to have. Um, and then I'll go to the gym. But that's as good as I can say. I don't think. I don't know. I've never been to the gym early. So but I always go after my third meal. Because um, then I've definitely got the energy. Um, which is about five, six, six o'clock, maybe. Um, so yeah, I've had my breakfast, oats and water, my my dinner, um, which is chicken, veg and rice, and my tea, which is chicken, veg and rice again. Um, and then I'm off to the gym. So that's what I do. Um, yeah. If that helps. You know, um, if you really want that sort of help in what to eat and a set plan I would suggest getting a trainer uh, or a, a prep coach let's say um, like I have Showgirl Fitness I definitely recommend that I've, since I've been on it it's been a brilliant absolutely brilliant yeah um, okay that's that one next one Tiffany asked advice for ass exercises food help and ab exercises Okay, ass exercises, ab exercises, and food help. Food help, like I just said to Ellie on the last one, in response to Ellie on the last one, um, I would I would suggest getting some help, someone to write you a plan uh, to help you along the way. Um, um, for ass exercises, okay, there's no. I'm just gonna say this I don't think you should just work your ass you can't just work your ass you need to work the rest as well obviously um, so you know you need to build up your quads build up your hamstrings and then build up your glutes so you're working all together so squats um, hamstring curls uh, reverse hyper extensions donkey kicks cable kickbacks um, good mornings um, hip thrusts, step ups, simple you know, things like that um, will help overall on the bottom, on your lower end, um, as well as um, deadlifts. Uh, there's different types types of deadlifts, so you'll have to find that out yourself. Um, ab exercises. Okay, that depends on your goal, on it, on what you wanna, what you wanna get. I used to do sit ups, um, straight leg sit ups every day, um, as well as bent leg sit ups on the little weird thing where you just balance and you have your lift legs up and down. I don't know what it's called. I did that every day and I got abs very easily. It thickened my waist though, so the more you do abs, the thicker your waist is going to be. Um, I now do abs once a week, um, sit ups, crunches, abs. Uh, sit up crunch side sit ups reverse sit ups planks yeah that's all I do currently about five sets uh, yeah I hope that answers your questions um, any other questions feel free to put in the comment box um, obviously I'll try and help as best I can it will make me feel more comfortable with making videos or any suggestions on what you'd like me to video would be great you know but just chuck it at me yeah I shall uh, I hope you enjoy the video <laughs>